Shalom, and welcome to this segment of Pillows on Prayer, where we're going to finish up the bracha of Hashivenu Avinu Lesorosecha. Usually the last phrase of, the, of, the, of the, every single bracha, what's referred to as the chasima, which starts off, Baruch Atah Hashem, the signature and the ending off of the bracha, usually it doesn't have so much content that we haven't seen before. It usually comes to sum up what we've seen. An example is the bracha of Atah Kadosh. We say Atah Kadosh, Veshimcha Kadosh, referring to the sanctity of God and how He's different than man. And we end off, Baruch HaTah Hashem, you're the source of all blessing, HaKel HaKadosh, the Kadosh God. It's just a summary of what we've seen before and doesn't really bring us any new ideas. This bracha, though, has something new in it. We say, Baruch HaTah Hashem, HaRotzeh B'Tshuva, you are the source of all blessing, Hashem, the one who, in a literal translation, it means, wants repentance was that Hashem actually wants repentance. Now when we talk about God, we know that God can have no wants, because God is perfect. Only something that is not perfect has a want, it has a need to fulfill, and it wants something. With God, we can't say that God has a want or has a will. There's really no English, lushon, uh, English lang word that can really describe and perfectly translate the word ratzon. Again, we tra generally translate it as someone's will, someone's, someone's want, someone's needs. Here, what Ratzon is like Ritsui, it means that is appeased, likes it. Really, when it comes to Hashem, again, you can't like and you can't, can't be appeased. The idea being that this is what Hashem demands. Generally, when we see that somebody has something that they demand, and the demand is met, that's the person's want. When it comes to Hashem, obviously, that's different. So what we're saying is, HaRotzeh B'Tshuva, that Hashem demands of us to perfect ourselves even when we've fallen. That's the concept of Tshuva of repentance. Hashem is, somebody that de Hashem is someone that demands repentance. HaRotzeh B'Tshuva, that's the idea. Again, you are the source of all blessing, the one who, Hashem, the one who demands Teshuva, demands repentance. That's today's Pillows on Prayer segment. Hope you enjoyed. Please join us tomorrow as we go on to the next bracha. Again, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to write. Pillows at BethJacob.org. Shalom.